Spencer Lewis here for InsideTrackNews.com. Post race to Sunset Speedway, August 2nd, with our feature winner of the mini stock division, the astronaut Brandon McFerrin. Brandon, you, you leave tonight with a three race winning streak intact. I think you're six or seven wins deep in the in the 2014 season. You expand your points lead. I mean, just an overall huge night for the 64 team. Yeah, you said it. Um, it was a really good point night. I had a lot of pressure on my on my shoulders going into tonight because the double points double points weekend. You know, tomorrow's points race too, um, making up for a rain out we had a few weeks ago. Um, so I knew tonight I had to keep my my nose clean, stay out of trouble. I started 16th, so that also put a lot of pressure on myself. Um, <clears throat> Usually when I do put a lot of pressure on myself, though, I do good. You know, if I don't feel that pressure on me, I, something happened. You know, it's it's weird. To, uh, I just find it, you know, a little things that's weird. But uh, a lot of pressure on my shoulders, and I did all right. Um, like I said, tomorrow's a points uh, points race as well, so uh, I had to keep my nose clean for that, so I can get points as much points as I can and keep the uh, consistent finishes coming. You gotta remember the pressure is a privilege, though, my man. I mean, if you're if you're at the front, I mean, that's that's uh, that's a gift to have that privilege. Now, now Jordan House tonight give you a huge run. Let's talk a little bit about that. You guys are both 15, but I feel as though you guys are both at different points in your career right now. You're you're a third year veteran. You've been around a long time in these in this mini stock division. Jordan sort of went the karting route for a little bit longer, just getting into full size stock cars now. And I mean, he, I think he impressed a lot of people. He went toe-to-toe -to -toe with yourself tonight. You ended up with the win, but uh, Jordan House made it close. Oh uh, yeah, you put, uh, like you said, we went toe-to-toe. -to -toe. He put a lot of pressure on me. Um, I helped him out there at the start of the year, shot, showed him the ropes around this place. Um, he caught on like the in the first 10 laps, man, you know, taught him the little crossover move, and I seen he tried it on me, and uh, it worked. He was there for a few laps. Um, Come back to bite me in the behind now because he's, he's coming up and contending for wins and stuff uh, I told you at the start of the year. He's gonna be good um, But yeah, I, I, I if he doesn't win this year um, I'm gonna be really surprised. I, I think in the next couple weeks. He's got a win coming for him So you're now in your third full season of competition in the mini stocks. I mean you're, you're winning features you're contending for a championship But do you feel like so you're still learning and, and developing with where you're at right now with your with your with your driving and your, your talent oh for sure i learn every every time i go out on the track um there's always something to learn um whether it's to back the corner up or or go in there a little deeper if you can um roll to the throttle or do you just you know the stuff you learn and you try and oh it works and if you try it, it doesn't work so you learn everything every time you go out on the track i find um if I'm still racing, you know, when I'm 50 or 55 or whatever, I'm still going to be learning. It's, everyone's learning every time they go out. And uh, I guarantee you go ask anybody, they're still learning. I know that none of this is possible with the proper support. And you, you've assembled such an awesome team, different guys sort of chipping in and helping. And you got a, a strong support system of marketing partners behind you. Thank the folks that, that have made this dream 2014 campaign possible for you. Yeah, I got for sure. Well, first, first and foremost, I got to thank mom and dad. I wouldn't be where I am or the guy I am today without, without them people. Um, they're awesome. Uh, I got to thank my sponsors, P D Peter D. Laird, Myers Construction, uh, Road Ranger, Finish Line Painting and Restoring, Absolute Website, Fast Eddy, uh, Epic Race where everyone that helps me out, man. Uh, whether it's you know looking good coming to the track, looking good in the fire suits, it's uh, everything's helping out. Uh, small things do go a long way, and I'm still looking for more. Um, I know a lot of people are, oh, why don't you move up to Vision? And uh, I would gladly, but I need sponsorship. So uh, I'm I'm open to getting sponsorship in. If anyone's looking uh, to sponsor a race car, pretty good way to promote your business. Um, contact me on Facebook, Brandon McFerrin. Um, shoot me a message and we'll talk. There you go, folks. And come up to Sunset Speedway and watch you go to work too, right? Yeah, exactly. Midway through his, uh, his championship campaign. It's only going to get better for the number 64 team. Brandon, thank you so much for the time. And uh, we'll check back in with you tomorrow, back half of the double shot. All right, thank you. It's the astronaut Brandon McFarland.